let's now bring in former governor of Himo State, Rocha Zokorocha, for more on the passing of uh, Emmanuel Iwayao. Good to have you join us on TVC News at 10. And uh, let me extend condolences to you over the passing of Chief Iwayao. Uh, how did you receive the news of his passing? And what are your fondest memories of him? Well, I'm um, very, very sad very big loss for indeed in this nation that like um Iwaya is a virgin, it's a patriot, it's a leader, it's a man that um gives for that counting cost of the Um it's a perfect life but it's uh, something that we ever be missed and remember about him. As a person of our eyes, when he did his speech, he did define the legal nation. So I think this nation is missing the thing. Of course, everyone in this country knows that he was a big man in business, a big man in sports, a big man in aviation, and a big man in politics. So, um, this is a great loss. And, uh, and, uh, and what? All right. Uh, what are your thoughts about immortalizing him and uh, maintaining his legacy? Well, the is not just—it's uh, not a myth. Um, he's a legend. 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 I think they were the first person to send this condolence message. We, we have some plans to do. Um, we, we might remember some of the things that we knew in the next days in life, talked about it. And uh, this, that one I did, the entire thing, so, yeah. I wonder was remembered for championing uh, the release of Nadi Kali. Uh, he's uh, he happening in the course of him, especially as he relates to uh, legal organization. So, a lot, I think there are many ways to honor the many that's known. Um, so, this is something that we're going to do. But definitely, you must take out more. Um, we give him the ability to marry. This is the state's man, he's the father of the state. So, a lot of things will be unfolding as the days go by. But what is important is to Remember um, the world's family prayers, especially the wife and the kids. Uh, um, because two days ago, I went to the hospital and I, I met with the wife and I saw, I saw the mood that she was in. So I went and was there for the husband. And I really uh, uh, salute her concern and commitment. So we should, this nation should remember in prayer and see how best it can be honored. You know, Naturally, when we talk about many ways and streets, I don't think that's uh, just what we really meant. Well, they came and died from speaking, the Hebrew, and it, I think this is the right time to use this uh, laws to build bridges of peace and the brotherhood and cause intimidation mm -hmm. and then that it was bad to build a bridge of peace the rest of the world. Right. This is what we are going to do. It's hard for the ways. So, right. um, Yes. Mm, and what is your call really to Ndigo in general at this time about uh, maintaining the legacy of the man, Emmanuel, in Wyoming? Well, um, you know, this life is a state. I mean, the world has played a role and it's gone. And the uh, uh, service has been transferred to new shoulders, leadership. So uh, the tolerance uh, is a way to go. And this is what Wyoming represents. Uh, building bridges of uh, peace is what the world is known for. Uh, in Divo, we will be seen to realign positively to the world national equation, be it in business or politics, and show that leadership that they are made, dramatize the peace that they are uh, I think this will be something that uh, the, the subsequent leader or the imagined leader is going to elect and follow suit. All right, then. Former Governor of Himo State, Rochas Okorocha, thank you for talking to us and sharing 
know, these fond memories you have of Emmanuel Yawayan. Thank you.